gotta show the skills. <sighs> ah! I don't know how I'm supposed to. <laughs> I want you to myself, won't share you with nobody else Label me a stingy nigga, something I can't help, yeah Fresh out the Vicky, we gon' play the cause you dealt I go flow with the 50, hit you right below the belt yeah. All I needed was a chance All I needed was a chance All I need If we fall off, I'll be back again Cause I ain't satisfied with crying hey pretties welcome back to my channel today's video i'm going to be doing a long awaited video not for just you girl but for me too all right because i know i've been waiting but so have i because i was just waiting for everything to come in you know i still didn't get everything y'all in this video like stuff are still coming in but i don't want to wait you know like i want this video out it's literally already like in the middle of january about to be and i'm like i'm about to start school too i want to like you know get these videos out the way like it's, it's literally the middle of january like girl before i even start this video disclaimer no way should perform am i bragging about what i God. Christmas is obviously about the birth of Christ, but obviously people also give and receive gifts and that's what my family does. Like, I've been talking like, girl, are you gonna do it or not? Like, what's going on? <laughs> so, I'm here. You guys know this is a tradition, so of course I was gonna do it. This is my fourth year doing this. I did my first one back in 2018. 2019 did my second one. The third one was last year and now we're back again, baby. This year I did give you guys a Christmas wish list. You guys know what I wanted to get for Christmas. With that being said, let's get right to the video. I have a lot of things I gotta show y'all and I don't wanna make it too long because y'all know I could soak up a story. I also want to quickly say that I'm so thankful for everything that I got. I'm thankful for my family for getting me things for Christmas. I know how it is. The older you get, the less stuff you do get. But I'm just so thankful that my family still, you know, goes out their way to give me exactly what I want. Or just, like, you know, acknowledge the fact that, you know, Christmas is my favorite holiday. I'm just so happy that, you know, I have family that still, you know, goes out their way and still treats me. Like, you know, if I never really grew up, like if I'm still a little kid. Of course, my gifts have matured and I'm more excited about stuff that I probably would not even have been excited about four years ago. But... But, you know, like, it just means a lot to me that people still out there with, like I said. I'm going to start off with the gifts I got for my grandma first because why not? Who doesn't love grandma? Like, y'all love grandma so much. If you're OG, you already know what I got. Like, my grandma did the same thing every single year. And I just love that because I already know what to expect, first of all. So I already know, like, you know, to make room for it. So the first thing I got for my grandma was this cute comforter. It's a queen size. It can go from, you know, this crazy, beautiful pattern to just gray. So I'm in love with that. It is an eight piece set, so you get the reversible comforter. You get two reversible shams, so you know, it will match whichever side you choose. And you get the four piece sheet set and the bed skirt. So I love that because I like to have the whole set matching. That's one thing about me. And I hate when a comforter only comes with, like, you know, the comforter, no pillows to match or anything like that. It's really annoying because you pay, like, so much money, you know, for it to not have everything. And baby, this is from Macy's, so it's very pricey. I already know I'm gonna get the best when it comes to her, so shout out to my grandma. Y'all should know what I got. And if you don't know, you're not an OG because baby all the ogs know what i got okay every single year if you guys don't know my grandma gets me a comforter and this could be like for any of the holidays my birthday christmas she always gives me like a nice little blanket i'm really happy about this it says luxurious false for why you throw it back so I got another gray, white, and black little theme going on. I really, really like this. I get cold a lot. Y'all already know I always get cold in general. So, you know, with that being said, I'm happy about this. I don't have as much blankets as I thought I had. A lot of them that I do have, I left in my mom's house. When I stay there, I still have those blankets. So I don't have them from my apartment. And that's new at that. Because if I'm being honest with you guys, I want, like, everything new. For the most part, because, you know, I'm in a new space. I want new things. And yet though it was over, y'all? No, baby. She got me another one, y'all. This one I actually got for Christmas early. I had originally asked her for a heated blanket blanket but she told me she's not gonna give me one because it's dangerous i don't know where that came from because nobody has ever said it was dangerous but she want to get it for me y'all and it has like you know cute little prints going on i just love to be like just covered up in this y'all like it's just i don't know something about this and i just love how i got two now because i can have one for my glare room because it matches my glare room so well and she knew that because obviously she's been in my house before like plenty of times she already knows the color themes with every room so this is gonna be for my glare room i want to chill here you know just relax and just be to myself you know sometimes i have my alone time i can sit right there in my chair and have this blanket next thing for my grandma to keep me warm are some socks she already knows she gave me socks every single year but she gave me socks like last month that wasn't for christmas i'm telling y'all know that i already got socks so she didn't like od like you know how she usually would do and it has a nice little grip so you know obviously i won't bust my ass <laughs> walking around with these on trying to be all cute because i'm clumsy i know this next thing i got was a whole bunch of lotions from bath and body works and y'all already know how i feel like bath and body works i have so many of their lotions she gave me so much every single year so i never gotta buy none personally for myself so shout out to my grandma. She always comes through with everything that I don't have to buy myself. I love 
I first I got this Amber and Argan one. It looks like this. It's really, really cute. Next one I got was this warm vanilla sugar. And I love anything that's like, you know, fruity, sweet, but also like a light smell. It's not too overbearing, especially when I'm putting it on my skin because y'all don't have eczema. So I, I can't really have too much scents going on. It has to just be like, you know, one scent or like a really, really light scent that won't irritate my skin. And vanilla sugar does not irritate my skin ever. I really, really like this one. This one smells so good. I love this one. This one smells mad good. And then I also got these body lotions. This is in the set fresh sparkling snow and then I also have this Capri Coastal Citrus and this one has shea butter and vitamin E last but not least for the bath and body works thing I did give me some foam and hand soap because I've been like annoying my grandma telling her that like, grandma I want some foam and hand soap so she was like girl take the freaking soap and shut up so I got the raspberry tangerine one and this has essential oils with it as well and this smells mad good I got my own bathroom now you know I just want to have everything smelling good you know when people come to my house they wash their hands and they be like oh my god this smells so good so and the last thing I got, which I did not open, so I'm gonna open on camera. I think I already know what it is though, because my grandma has a habit of telling me stuff that I got before I even open it. Not, not even, y'all. She like asked me, like, do you like this? And then be like, okay, you get it on Christmas. Like, why would you tell me grandma that I'm getting it on Christmas? You could just said, okay, you like it, okay, cool. Like, you didn't have to tell me to get it on Christmas, but now I know what I'm getting. Uh, I'm wearing these right now because my feet, I'm not gonna lie, are kind of getting a little bit cold. These are all super soft, so they have like, you know, a nice little grip at the bottom. But these right here, they're so comfortable. Look at the inside. They're like my blanket. Yeah, I'm about to be so warm in my house. Like, so shout out to my grandma. I love you so much. And thank you so much for all my gifts. I really do appreciate you. So, yeah, moving on to what my auntie got me. Y'all already know what she got me actually because I had opened it up on camera. And my aunt got me exactly what I asked her for for uh, Alexa and she got me it and I've been wanting an Alexa Echo Dot for so long I don't know I feel like everybody that has their own apartment or their own place always gets an Echo Dot and I'm like I want one you know and you could tell her like you know what time is it wake me up at this time what's the weather so I got that thank you auntie so much for that and my money of course so moving on so what my uncle got me first up I got me some pink dunks y'all already know half about pink and a half about dunks I only have two pairs and I want to grow my collection of of course because summer's right around the corner honestly what's about to be over i know it might not look like it but it baby's gonna be summer real soon i asked them for these already and i got these when they came out but they're like an early christmas gift as well that's why i'm showing you guys them now and i don't even think i have any pink like regular sneakers like i have like pink foreigns but sneakers i don't think so i may be mistaken because there ain't no way i don't got no pink sneakers that kind of be like you know kind of crazy but like updated like new sneakers i don't so these are my first pink new sneakers and last but not least i got from my uncle which i was so surprised about because I didn't tell him what I wanted either so I was like what did he get me so he got me some Yeezys when I opened it I was like what type of Yeezys are these like I didn't what like I've never heard of these so he got me the new 450s that just came out the green ones these are so cute one thing about me I love green like green is just my color I feel like I already know this comfort is gonna be something different because they look like a sock I probably don't gotta wear no socks with these that's how real it is cute his girlfriend had actually got me an Ulta gift card we gonna spin this up I already know what I want I mean it's Ulta so, you know I wear makeup, like, that's not a problem. Thank you, uncle. Thank you, Lauren. I appreciate y'all. Alright, y'all, so let's move on to what my boyfriend got me. He got me exactly what I asked for this year. Usually, he'll, like, get me, like, a different color of what I asked for because he wants to get me what he think will be cute. Like, everything something's cuter, he'll get that color instead of the color that I really, really want. But, nah, this year, he actually got me exactly, exactly to the T what I want. I was pretty surprised. I was like, oh, shoot. Okay, okay. Y'all, I don't know how I could have possibly missed, like, the 8,000 jobs, but I did. We here with it now. That's all that matters. So, I don't know. It was, like, so weird. Like, it was, like, a random day. Like, I just saw it, and I asked him, like, should I get this bag? This bag is cute. He was, like, just order it. I'm giving you money for it. And I did just that because maybe... Why Why would I pass up a tofu easy? And I'm trying to figure out who gonna have to go. You know right now I got one, two, three, four, five, six tofars in my purse glass shelf right now. And one gonna have to go because she got one side. The detailing, y'all, it's just so, like, look at it, it's so pretty. We got her. I didn't open her yet. She's got the plastic one because I gotta get the shoes first. And then we're gonna bring her out. Next thing I got, which was also on my Christmas wish list, was some crops. <laughs> okay, this year I really wanted crops because I have, like, a obsession with crops now. I don't know what it is. Um, after my brother got me those Crocs a couple of months ago for my birthday, I just been obsessed with them all over again. I was obsessed back, like, I think it was my sophomore year of high school when I showed y'all what I got for back to school, I think. I don't remember. Like, I had, like, a little pulls on them. But now I'm back again. Like, I'm back again. They're very comfortable. I'm in college now. Got me some Crocs. These are pink. Of course, my favorite color. And I really, really wanted these so bad, y'all. Y'all don't understand. 
All right, y'all don't understand. As soon as I saw that it was pink, y'all, that was it for me. That's all I ever needed. Like, they're pink. And then, y'all, last but not least, I don't know if my toe for leg or if this is my favorite gift, but last but not least, I got me some foam for that. Look at her. Y'all gotta see her. Yeah, I don't think I see her. First of all, I wanted these, but I was like, you know, when I get my pair, because I have to come by to myself, like, I want them to have so much pink in it. Like, I don't want them to have, like, you know, a little bit of pink, because a lot of them have, like, a little bit of pink in them. Mine have mad pink in them, and I'm really, really happy about that, because y'all know my favorite color is pink. And the other shoe got mad pink in it, too. Ah! So I'm really, really excited about these, y'all. Like, I am excited. They're so freaking cute. They're so girly. They're so me. So comfortable as well. I'm excited. I gotta wear these. So thank you, babe, for all my gifts. I appreciate you so much. All right, y'all. So moving on to my mom got me for Christmas. Like I told you, I don't have everything. Stuff is still on the way. And when it comes, I'm gonna be gone already. So I didn't wanna, like, you know, make this video mad late when I come back. Because when I come back, I'm starting school. I'm gonna be busy. I don't want none of that in my way. I want to get everything out while I'm still free, while I still have time. And I'm not, I'm busy, but I'm not too busy. So you guys know that I wanted some stuff in my glam room. I told her exactly what I wanted. I gave her the links and everything and then like two days before Christmas she was like, you know what? I'm giving you the money. You're gonna buy it yourself because I don't want it to come here and you gotta travel all the way back with it. That's too much work for you. That's not cool. I want you to have it, you know, when you there. So she gave me the money for it. So shout out to my mom. She gave me money to buy my gold clothing rack that I desperately have been wanting for so long and I was also able to get my neon name sign because I also asked my mom for that for Christmas as well so that's coming so thank you mommy so much for that I appreciate you so much all right y'all so moving on to the final person that got me something for Christmas which was my dad I know y'all love my dad I know y'all love me my dad relationship and my dad comes through every single year before I get into what my dad got me y'all this year so my dad I gave him a list of stuff that I wanted but then after I took it back and I told him I don't want nothing for Christmas because he also watched my video y'all so he would know what I wanted anyways even if I told him like you know I don't want nothing he still was gonna watch anyways and figure out what I wanted my dad is just like that no matter what I say he always wants to get me something he's just amazing and I really feel like that's why I got it from him. and that's kind of a good and bad thing for us we like to make people happy and my dad does just that for me all the time and I really really do appreciate him because I told him I do not want nothing and he still got me something <laughs> And also, yeah, the whole last year, I'm saying last year because, you know, it is 2022 now, but, but you know, it doesn't really feel like it because, you know, 2022 just came. As I was moving into my apartment, y'all saw my dad was helping me move. He brought me so many things from my apartment. He, like, helped me with so many things that I needed. Like, he is so supportive. He does so much for me. Like, throughout all the years, forget just this year, my whole life, you know, just like my mom, my whole life, my parents have done so much for me. My whole family has done so much for me. So, for you guys that don't know, my dad had got me a car for my 18th birthday. It was honestly both of our jeans. My dad had has always wanted to get me a car. I'm his first and only baby, so for him, it's like one of the goals that he always wants to accomplish. So when the time came, he was able to do it. He did it for me, and I really do appreciate him. For those of you that don't know, a car costs a lot of money. The car that I got costs a lot of money. I got a 2018 Jeep Wrangler, a Willys edition, and it's unlimited. So the package is a lot higher than the basic, you know, price for just without all the stuff that I got extra. On. After I thought about what I was asking for Christmas, I was like, you know what? Let me relax. We go shopping almost every, honestly, not even almost. We, we go out shopping every weekend we literally just stopped doing it like probably November like end of November you go shopping every weekend like hundreds of dollars I'm not trying to brag y'all I'm just letting y'all know like the facts so me thinking about that how much my dad be spending on just buying me things and I'm just like I'm asking for more for Christmas that's too much I'm not blind to it but it's just like this year I realized like my dad got me a car like I obviously I realized that but if you get on to if people that know what I'm saying they don't know what I'm saying people that want to be dumb and try to act like you know how she know her dad brought her the stuff that she he buys her everything that I, I know that already that's not the point because I you already know I buy my own stuff too it's not one-sided thing and I also buy my dad stuff too it's not as much as him but I'm trying to get there but my whole point of saying this is he also got his own car he also got his own bill and I feel like now that I if my own stuff now like my bill it's like I realize how much my dad paid and my dad also owns his own barbershop so obviously he has to pay his rent on that as well because he owns the barbershop it's crazy to me that I have to get my own bills and all that to realize how much stuff add up I'm over here sending him a Christmas list like for what my dad deserves stuff for me more than I deserve stuff from him I appreciate my dad so much and everybody else about something so much, my whole family so much that now that I'm older now, it's like when you get older, you start to realize like, you know, that's a lot of money. They got to take stuff out their pocket and it's like they have bills too. He just did too much and I was like, daddy, I don't want nothing. <laughs> I don't want a thing. Like, I don't want anything. So, yeah. 
yeah shout out to my daddy i appreciate you so much dad and i know you're gonna watch this video and you're probably gonna cry <laughs> but i love you so much and i'm just so appreciative for you seriously so that's all that's all i was trying to say before i get to what he got me because my dad he does too much you know and i just want to make sure that doesn't not go unnoticed even though i tried not to make anything that anybody can go unnoticed but you know just want to let y'all know all right y'all so let's start with the first thing that my dad got me first thing that he got me was this cute 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 set y'all and i'm actually i was thinking about it i'm like this outfit would be so cute to actually wear to college because it's like a cute little you know lounging cute little fit like you know i'm going to college and have my little coffee like it just give that vibe so it's a brown three-piece set it comes with this cute little like sweater or cardigan whatever you want to call it and it's so funny because i used to wear cardigans all the time when i was in middle school cute little tank it's teddy bear material it was a pants for me like my dad already knows how i feel about the browns and like neutral colors and this is gonna match my yeezy phone so cute y'all i'm gonna wear my yeezy phone this is gonna be so cute so like i said the three-piece set is gonna be so perfect with my yeezy phones not the ones i got for my boyfriend the ones i brought myself like i don't know if they call the orchard i don't know how to say the name y'all but those brown ones that i got it's gonna be so cute with it when it gets nice and warm outside you know like the nice 75 degrees outside that weather i'm gonna wear this next thing that my dad got me y'all was so funny because he knows i like to travel a lot and he just kept telling me like i need this i need this i need this and i just kept telling my daddy like i do not need this like i'm not going nowhere but my dad is always like yeah you never know like you know you, you need it ahead of time this is what he got me y'all y'all probably like what is that this is a security lock for like you know your luggage and stuff when you travel for my birthday trip i'm definitely gonna use this moving on my dad got me this security camera for my home and it's hd baby it's 1080p this is a smart wi-fi auto tracking camera so you know it tracks like the movement in your house so any motion it will track it it says it keeps intruders pets and children in focus so good because i already know my child is my pet my pet is my child and it also has automatic night vision for security and clarity day or night so i love that you can check in from your phone which i love like i said it will notify me on my phone and it also says i could chat and listen so it comes with a powerful built-in mic so you could interact or quietly listen from any location so i could listen to my house as well i'm not just seeing like you know stuff going on so if diamond is crying i can hear her what i love about this as well it connects with alexa and y'all know i got me alexa so this is perfect next thing my dad got me was this pink water bottle i was like that didn't want that water bottle so he got me this one i don't know why i just like to collect water bottles y'all that's really what it'd be like if it's pink i want it this is a latte tumbler so you could put either hot or cold drinks in here it'll keep it hot or cold after christmas me and my dad went shopping of course and my dad got me a couple of things from primark he got me two leggings but i already wore them so they're in a hamper i also got me this mask because it had an eye on it and i never see anything with an eye on it so when i saw this i was like i gotta get it my perfect opportunity to give me something with my initial on it because if i don't get it now i won't have it later so i got me this nude sweater because i just wanted a new sweater i don't have any it matches my skin set that i had got a while back that i already wore and i wore it actually in a vlog it's probably gonna come out after this video so you already saw it matches it so perfectly so i'll be happy that I got this sweater. For those of you that follow me on TikTok already saw me wear this. So y'all already know what I'm talking about. But for those who didn't, baby, look at this beautiful jacket like or coat, whatever you want to call it. It's so cute. I couldn't pass it up. There was only like three left and this was in my size. I was like, let me get it now because it's not gonna be here later. I already know because it's good quality. This don't scream me right here, like <laughs> this don't scream me like fly. This is like everything, like. This is so cute. Y'all already know the one I got for Fashion Nova is the same exact thing, like the G material. Same concept, just the fur is green. And I don't think it has a hoodie though. Dude, I'm not sure, but this one has a hoodie, baby. Oh, I don't know why did that. It's the pockets for me. It's just too cute. And last but not least, one of the things that I asked for my Christmas wish list for my dad, he actually got for me, which I was like so surprised. The list that I had given my first job that I told him I don't want nothing, it was sold out. And I was like, you know what? I don't want nothing anyways. So that's a good thing that it was sold out. And then he had found an alternative to what I wanted. I was like, oh, I like that bag. That bag is cute. And he was like, they only got red in it. And I was like, oh, I don't want red. And he found the exact color y'all that I had wanted. Like, how did you get this? I really just asked for this. Like, how, like he told me, like, how did I get his Palm Angels hat when he just asked for it? I was surprised he got me this. I just asked for it. And baby, look at it. And this is how the bag comes. I'm going to definitely keep the dust bag, of course. I just love bags and y'all know that y'all know I'm a bag of whole like I have too many bags to count are you ready okay <laughs> look at her she is so cute y'all know I wanted this pink bag the one that I originally wanted was sold out y'all already know me baby I must pop up with this bag y'all gonna love the fit like I already know yeah, I love the style of the bag too because I don't have no style like this at all so yeah again somebody in my purse glass shelf gonna have to go because baby the new additions is coming through this is the second one I'm really happy about this bag y'all alright y'all so we're on to the last portion of the video you guys already know 
what time it is. Y'all already know I just think buys herself something for Christmas every single year. Most of the time I accumulate a lot of items because I always make that excuse to buy it because you're a Christmas gift to yourself and I end up with like mad stuff that I got myself for Christmas. We're here again, doing that again. We need to stop. But I feel like it's so therapeutic, not because I'm spending money on myself, but also for me, I feel like it's self-love to myself. It's always rewarding to give myself something for Christmas because it's like, that's your reward for like doing what you're supposed to do this year. Like setting goals for yourself and completing the goals. Like as long as you're doing it and doing it well, baby, that's that. All right, y'all, so first thing I got myself, y'all already saw me get this, but I want to show it because I was using it two days ago and I'm in love with it already. I didn't even use it on my whole house yet, but I love it already. I got me a Shark Steam and Scrub Steam Mop and I'm in love with this, y'all. If you will think about buying this, buy it. Cause I was thinking about buying this for like a couple of months and I just never bought it. It went on sale, I was like, a little so can't hurt. Like, you know, mm. I was not even thinking about this, but now that I'm older, baby, this is everything. I love this. All right, y'all, so moving on. Next thing that I got myself, this right here, baby. I don't know why y'all I was like feeding to buy me a donut maker but I ended up buying me a donut maker a mini donut maker at that and it's too cute and it comes with a recipe for chocolate mini donuts I'm gonna probably put sprinkles on that so I got me these two sweaters they're just basic crop sweaters but they're like good quality y'all and I just realized y'all this one matches the easy foams that my boyfriend got me so that's the outfit y'all see like so also you guys I got me some pajama sets because I told myself I want to get me some new pajama sets for the new year I'm tired of wearing mismatch like I don't like that vibe and a lot of my pajamas I want to throw away because they're like you know they're dingy they're old I need some new ones. I just want to wear sets. I'm tired of wearing mismatch. Like, it's okay to wear a tank top with boxes. I do that all the time, but I want to have cute, like, pajama sets as well. First, I got me this set. This one is so cute. It gives me Victoria's Secret vibes. It's black and white with the button up. It has the shorts with the drawstring to match. Really cute. Next and last pajama set that I got myself was this pink one. And this one's long sleeve, and the material is different. So, these are what the bottoms look like. They're real cute, very comfortable. All right, y'all. So, we're going to stop with clothes for a second because I had got me some more essentials for my home. Oh, wait a Y'all, how I just talked about how my dad broke his candle. I'm opening up my candle and it's broken. So I can't even use this candle. And I swear, if my other candles are broken, I'm going to be so pissed. Please, God. <laughs> Please. Yay, this one's good. Okay, got me this coconut flower one. It was only $6. And look how aesthetically pleasing it is. Nice, new color. It can match my living room. Love that. So I got that. And the last one, I hope this one's not broke. It doesn't feel like it's broken, though. So the last candle I got was this fresh snowfall candle. I know it's past Christmas. And it's about to snow, actually, on Sunday. So it's still in the box. So next up, I got me this robe. It came with a scrunchie. It came with two scrunchies, actually. I got me this because I need a new robe. I don't know where my robes went. I thought I brought them, but when I went back home, I don't see them there either, so I don't know where they are. So I got me a new one, and this one is a plush one. Satin robe owners, let's be honest. We are still cold. Even though we look cute, we be cold. And I wanted a cute little plush one to be nice and warm. Last but not least, my clothing items, y'all. I brought me a whole bunch of skin sets because I love skins. You already know. I was obsessed with the one skin set that I ever owned, which was an off-white one. And I just needed another one. I was like, nah, I gotta buy me another one. And skins had a sell, baby. The Black Friday sale, they had a sell. So I was like, let me get me my stuff now, early for Christmas. I wish I I like the cute skins package like you know when the skins all around it and stuff but this, this right here is cute too and so i got me a pink like rosy set this set is really good like the quality of the hoodie is double padded so it keeps you nice and warm so yeah when i got this set i was so happy like i love this so much these pants are like huge on me y'all and i love how the drawstring is inside so it doesn't mess up the look yeah next set that i got was the same collection just a different color this is the gold color i think and this one is really really cute like the green is everything i love this green online it doesn't look as green though but it is Wait a minute. Now, this is gonna work. This is perfect. This one is the leggings, and I was fiending for the leggings, y'all. I was fiending. And I love all the, her leggings like this. And I gotta get me some more sets to go back to school. All right, y'all. So, the last items I got from Skins, I didn't even open these because I had ordered these and they had came, but I was in New York. I got me a two piece set. Are they the same size? I never had this color or this type of set before, but I had the same material. Black girl luxury vibes. I feel like I just wear this around the house as well, or just when I'm running errands real quick. But since it's like cold right now, obviously I won't do that right now. The way they shape your body, baby, they like, make my butt look good. So I had to get the shorts. Moving on to the next item I got myself for Christmas. This one is very like sentimental to me. This is something that I had for the last eight years of my life, and I lost it at Rolling Loud. You guys know this, and Rolling Loud is like 
done you're done so this was really sentimental for not just me but my mom too so when i got her one i got me one as well and this is my new bracelet i only have two charms on it right now because i was too focused on getting my mom her charm but one of them say daughter because i got my mom the mother one to match it was a two-piece set and i also got me this traveling charm because you guys know i love traveling and my bracelet is not a heart like my last one was it's a crown because like you know i'm a princess moving on with accessories i'm gonna show you guys my bags that i got but y'all know i love this brand baby so when i saw this bag y'all i had to cop it listen y'all watch bubbles the baddie on YouTube. She texted me like, girl, are you up? I was like, yes, girl. We was both like, all right. Oh my God, which one should we get? What size? And y'all don't know how excited I was to get this bag, y'all. Because this is my first ever medium size tail bar. Y'all already know all my tail bars are small. But now your girl is definitely like certified. I'm just so obsessed with this bag. Like this bag is just everything. Like it's so cute. Next and final bag, y'all, that I got is this bag that was on my Christmas wish list. You guys know. The other one was on my Christmas wish list too, but I already got it before Christmas. I didn't add it, but this one right here. I wanted this bag so bad because it's another color that I don't have for my designer collection. When I first wanted it, right, I sent it to my dad and my boyfriend. Then they both said it's out of stock. I just kept checking back on it to see if it come back, come back, and it never did. And I was so mad. I was like, oh my gosh, like I wanted this bag so bad. So one day I just checked out of nowhere, y'all just check, and it was back in stock. I was like, that's my cute like that's my sign to get the bag right now i already wore it for a photo shoot you guys already saw i got the last one i was not gonna play like oh y'all this bag gotta get displayed it's not gonna not get displayed she's an exclusive even on Kara official website is sold out so she's exclusive exclusive so i got me some crocs these ones are so cute these are what the crocs look like these are so cute y'all they have the strap they kind of feel like an off-white vibe because of the colors the orange especially last shoes that i got myself they fire and i've been feeding for these y'all see the vibe got the babies we finally got the ricky the girls can't even talk now. Like, I got the shoe. Okay, let me show you guys them close up. I need both the knee highs, y'all, and these. All right, you guys, this is the end of what I got for Christmas. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm so blessed to have an amazing family. Shout out to the Goodman family. Shout out to my parents. Shout out to my boyfriend. I appreciate you guys so much for everything. Y'all thought about me this year, as y'all do every other year, and I appreciate you guys so much. I know this video is so late, but again, happy new year, happy holidays, and I love you guys so much, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye, pretties. Ain't never been with a chick this bad. I ain't worried about that. Ain't never been with a chick this bad.